Yo everybody, welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Magic The Gathering Arena. We need to do some quests. Possibly should do some historic stuff over... Uh, instead of um, just angel stuff, but when I get lucky with an angel deck, it can really take off. Hmm... I threw this in here because it can really trigger a lot of nice stuff if we can get some life gain. The Exile the Book of Death thing doesn't really make much difference for us. Mm. Hello. I should say. Um, I guess I just need to hope for some more mana. One more, and we can at least get you two going. Two more, we can get Cosmic. Cosmos, even. Those you planes. Hmm. Well, poo. <sighs> At least I would still beat the blades as they are right now. Uh. Because the double strike and the first strike are the same. Oh, come on, game! <laughs> oh, this is going to be a pain to deal with. Given how it will allow them to get more creatures out, which will instantly negate this. <sighs> so I. Th <sighs> it might be worth putting a couple more land in. <laughs> But every time I think that, I always imagine the games that have the... that I just get flooded. Okay, what do we get rid of? I think it's you. I'm not overconfident. You're just underwhelming. I have got new moves to teach you. If I don't get a land this turn, then I think we're gonna have to. I think we're gonna have to concede because. Things are just going to get worse and worse for me because you're just going to get to the point where you can tap everything. Um, I mean, even now it might be too late. Strike fast and strike hard. <sighs> Which is really dumb and annoying. Ah, <laughs> you got you gotta love the mana in this game. But hey ho. 
I, I feel like though those kind of games where you just get mana screwed probably annoy me more than some of the ones where it's against a very cheap deck or whatever. Because it's like, well, I feel like it happens a lot. And I know it happens a lot because I'm bad at making decks, but still. Two of these and you are just insane. Um... Hello. Oops, dropped my pencil. Submit you, put you down. It's one of the rare cases where putting the white on this is probably worth better. Death touch haste. Well, ain't that annoying. Um... Because next turn I'm going to put the elixir out. Gonna keep killing them. No reason not to. And it also hopefully keeps the keeps them from building up. Okay. Annoying, but okay. Lock you. Risky because they have a lot of stuff, but once again, it seemed wrong not to try. Just getting one of these out will make a huge difference. Slightly annoying, but I couldn't risk losing what's her face. Might as well attack with everyone.
Oh, <laughs> I was just like holding my breath there. It's like when someone's looking like they're going to lose and they say good game, I'm always like, wait, do they actually mean that or do they have the upper hand? Are they seeing something I don't see? And then I start to second guess, especially when they start doing things afterwards. Either way, thank you all for watching and I'll catch you in the next episode. Goodbye.